Hey, this is Chris from Pastor Chris RN. Don't forget caregivers this 4th of July here in the United States. There are millions of people putting their lives on hold to care for a loved one who is in constant need of care. Rather than putting them in a nursing home, they make the courageous choice to take care of them at home so the loved ones can be with their family. These awesome people have to be a constantly on guard uh, with a loved one who suffers from Alzheimer's or some other form of dementia. They have to protect them, keep them safe. And oftentimes it's like keeping up with a toddler that's constantly on the go. Then there are diaper changes in the middle of the night. And all through the day, there's cleaning and bandaging wounds. There's dressing and undressing. There's feeding. There's bathing. Each act done as an act of love. For many uh, patients, uh, those who are terminally ill or in need of constant care, they live with pain, especially loved ones who are losing a battle with cancer. There's dealing with the outbursts of anger and agitation that come with increased anxiety, being disoriented and confused. And all the while, all this is going on. They're caring for their loved ones at their worst. Being a caregiver means sacrificing holidays. Often uh, caregivers are unable to put any energy into relationships and to keeping friendships. They're often feeling very alone and isolated and weary. Worshiping at a church or other place of worship is extremely difficult. Most cases, they can't even get their loved one out of the house. And each holiday, just like this upcoming 4th of July, is quite possibly the last holiday that they will spend with their loved one. So I hope you take a moment and reflect on this. Offer a prayer for a caregiver you know. Better yet, Offer to give them some time off to let them get some rest and reconnect with people and friends. Don't leave them alone. Give them a break. And spread this word around, please. And let's show our thankfulness and gratitude for the caregivers we know in our lives that take care of ones that we love and care about so much.